I'm going to find this by completing the square. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is subtract 3 from both sides. Then I'm going to have 2x squared minus 5 is equal to negative 3. I'm going to factor out a 2, so I get x squared minus 5 halves. And then I'm going to take half of this, which is uh, 5 over 4, and square that. So I get 25 over 16. And then this gets multiplied by 2, so I get negative 3 plus 25. It's 50 over 16, but it does the same thing as 25 over 8. All right, so you get 2 quantity x minus um, 5 over 4 squared is equal to So this equals negative, not negative, it's just 1 over 8. Divide through by 2. We get x minus 5 over 4 equals 1 over 16. Add 5 over 4. Actually, I take that back. Sorry. Um, so I get x minus 5 over 4. It's equal to 1 over 16. Take square to both sides. Um, then I'm left with x minus 5 over 4 is equal to plus or minus 1 over 4. And then here, um, add um, 5 over 4. 5 over 4. I get x is equal to 1 fourth plus 5 over 4. And 5 fourths minus 1 over 4. So finally, x is equal to this is 6 over 4, which is 3 halves. And 5 over 4 minus 1 fourth is 4 over 4, which is just 1. That's it.